The moment you hit your 20s, you picture yourself living a life painted in the hues of success and fulfillment. But as you dip your toes into the adulthood, reality hits hard. More than half of American adults are feeling the financial pinch in their 20s, leaving paycheck to paycheck and by 30s, they earn even less than $20,000 a year in some cases. It's a far cry from a comfortable lifestyle that you once envisioned. Because living expenses are getting out of hand, the average monthly cost of living for a single person in the United States is a hefty $3,189. And if you dare to drink dream of starting a family in your 20s, the number shoots up to a whopping $7,095 a month for a family of four. So where opportunities are scarce, competition is fierce, and the living expenses are just wild, where should you steer your career? So in this video, I want to share the 11 high income skills that I truly believe that you can learn within 90 days or less. If executed properly, you can actually earn a full time income from these. The reason why I'm sharing this is because I have been there, done it myself. The old school path of college, a degree and a job wasn't cutting it like it used to. Honestly, I used to be all in on the plan of spend four years in college chasing a business degree only to end up scratching my head and thinking, what am I really learning that could help me make money quickly? Because while I was in college, I was struggling with my basic living expenses. With no more opportunities available, I started learning about the most demanding skills just to keep my head above the water. And I found my golden ticket to a flourishing career. Did I blame the economy? No. Did I stuck into a low paying job? No. Instead, I switched on my career path by picking up some skills that could really bring some decent income. Another great thing about the skills that I'm going to share is that they're future-proof. Because according to an EDX study, half of the workforce skills will become obsolete in the next two years. And I don't want you, and I don't want to share some skills that you jump into and the next few years they don't matter anymore. I mean, OpenAI Sora can now make videos with just some text input. So this could be all obsolete at some point. But out of these 11 skills, there are two that I'm particularly excited about. Why? Because I have been there, done them myself. And let me tell you, they were a complete game changer for me. First skill that took my earning from around $4,000 to $6,000 a month. And the second one, well, that brought me to a whole new level, a whopping $10,000 to $12,000 a month. And by the end of the video, I'm going to expose something that none of these online coaches and gurus want you to know about. Web development. So there I was underwater with my living expenses and looking for a way out. I was hearing about this web development thing that was in demand and instantly all those mind boggling quotes popped up in my head. I'll be honest, it sounded like a rocket science. But here's the thing. As I dig a little deeper, I realized that it's not as tough as it seems. What really blew my mind was realizing you don't really need a fancy college degree to dive into it. I got my first start with WordPress, out of all things. Picture me huddled on over my computer soaking up everything I could get from YouTube tutorial of all places. I was hooked on the idea of how straightforward it all was. You've got to understand, I was not a coder. I used to think that you had to be some sort of wizard to build a website. Finding WordPress was like stumbling onto a secret passage and you know what they say, when you find something that good, you need to see if there's a demand for it. And that's exactly what I did. I put myself out there on all the freelancing sites, offering my newfound skills to others. I had this crazy thought, what if this could be my big break? And guess what? It was the first skill that truly catapulted my earnings, pulling in somewhere from four to $6,000 a month. For someone who was in a tight financial pinch, that was like winning a lottery. And it was my hard work that started paying off. But nowadays, there are plenty of amazing tools that can help you create engaging websites without writing a single code, like Framer, Webflow, Shopify. And some of these tools are way easier than WordPress and they look and functions amazing. Now, remember how I learned that skill, YouTube. Every minute, 500 hours of videos are being uploaded on YouTube. And that brings us to our second skill video editing. Now, one thing I need to let you guys know about me, I suffer from a disease. The scientific name of that disease is HHCIB, commonly known as, how hard could it be? When I started making YouTube videos, I thought, light yourself, sit in front of the camera, tell your story, cut here and there, boom, ready to upload. How hard could it be, right? I realized from very early on in this YouTube content creation journey that it's not only about putting together sounds, camera, lights, and telling an interesting story in front of the camera. The main key is the video editing to put it all together and tell a compelling story. Let me tell you, video editors get paid really, really, really good money. Trust me, I tried to hire one for myself and I was quoted one kidney and two ounces of my blood. They make really good money, there's no doubt about it. There's a video editor who ended up making $2 million from an ad revenue agreement, which is absolutely 
crazy. From the very first video till now, I edit all my videos. Everything that you see and all the shenanigans that I do with my video are all done by me from the beginning to end. You might be familiar with tools like Final Cut Pro, DaVinci Resolve, or Adobe Premiere. Now, did I know anything about it? Absolutely not. Had no idea about video editing whatsoever. Taught myself for free, and you guessed it, from YouTube, and gave it a go. I used to edit with Premiere, but now I switched to Vinci. Best decision ever, by the way. Am I the best at it? Far from it. But I'm learning with every single one of the video. With my every post, I try to do something new with my video. Maybe a new text layer or a new animation. Anything that makes my video stand out from the rest. Master these tools and get better at video editing and you'll be well above six-figure income. And hopefully one day I can work with you to edit my video so I can focus on strictly content creation. Content creation. Now, my content creation came from scrolling through YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, you name it. And I saw finance videos are quite uh, boring. And most of the finance gurus are know-it-all, as if they came out of their mother running a Fortune 500 company. On the other hand, I learned everything about finances by my mistake. Lots and lots of them. Then it hit me, I could be on the other side of the screen. I had this lightning idea moment and realized that why not share my own stories, tips and ideas, but specifically my mistakes. Made boring finance videos more entertaining, something like, entertainment. That's how I started dabbling into content creation. I began posting videos on my channel off my money mistakes so that way you don't have to make those mistakes. I'm far from being the finance guru, but sharing my mistakes felt like stepping into a whole new world. It wasn't all smooth sailing. At first, I felt like I was shouting into a void. No views, no likes, and definitely no comments. To some extent, they're still the same now, except for my mother, who still religiously shares my videos on her social media. I don't make a single dime off of ad, sponsorship, affiliate marketing, selling my own stuff, absol absolutely nothing. I pay out of pocket for all the help that I get to make these videos, pay handsomely with my sweat and tears to produce these videos. But if I'm not making any money, why am I doing this? There's a thing that I believe in, it's called delayed gratification. Imagine you've got a delicious chocolate bar sitting right in front of you. You can eat it now, for sure. But if you wait a bit, maybe save it for after dinner, or you might get something even better. Maybe instead of one chocolate bar, you can have two. It's all about waiting for a bigger and better reward instead of going for something that's immediate payoff. You know how some people, you know how some people say that they did this, they did that, and they ended up getting the result well, not here. I have accepted at a very early age that anything that I wanted, I could get it, but it wasn't going to come to me easy. There will be some hard work involved and all this hard work with this channel will pay off at some point. And I hope you'll be a part of this journey to see me reach that point. Hi, my name is Sister Rivers. I'm a real time and diversified investor and you are here for your dose of entertainment. If you want to continue watching great content, subscribe to my channel below and press the bell icon. The subscribe button will show you when my videos are being uploaded on YouTube. And when you sign up for your favorite creator newsletter, you receive these engaging emails. Ever wondered how influencers churn those engaging posts and emails day after day? Copywriting. Well, here's the secret. Most of them use what I call leverage writing method. They simply pass their thoughts and ideas to the copywriter. It's the copywriter's job to transform these messages into a captivating copy. And guess what? Businesses are hungry for skilled copywriters because they simply can't write enough pieces of content about, about themselves. Starting out, copywriters can make around $1,500 to $3,000 a month. But if you're really good at it and constantly adding value, you can easily make up to $5,000 to $7,000 or even $10,000 a month. But unfortunately, writing engaging content is not enough. People also have to find those contents besides emailing them directly to the reader. Ever wondered how Google displays results after a search? That's SEO at work. SEO involves optimizing digital content to rank higher in the search engine results. This includes aligning contents, keywords, and technical aspects to meet search engine's criteria. YouTubers, bloggers, and website owners Everyone is hunting for SEO experts to boost their online visibility. And you can earn around $5,000 a month if you crack this most wanted skill. Now, one of the important aspects of YouTube videos is search engine optimization. But did you know that design influences nearly 94% of first impressions and that the human brain processes visual information 60,000 times faster? Imagine this. You clicked on this video, seeing the thumbnail of this video. If thumbnail was awful, you wouldn't have clicked on it. You wouldn't have watched it till now. How I know it? Well, look at my old thumbnails. They're awful. I used to make my thumbnails during the beginning of this chat. Newsflash, they're awful because I suck at Photoshop. I was lucky enough to be able to work with some talented designers 
who are helping me to this day and designing thumbnails for each of these videos. So mastering this skill is definitely worth it. And it's not only the thumbnail designing. Graphic design is a necessary skill all over the internet and in any industry. Just learn the fundamentals of color theory, typography, and layout, and master tools like Adobe Creative Suite, and you are all set for a great career. You can expect to earn around $6,000 to $7,000 a month with these skills. Project management. Working with different designers for different projects requires some sort of management, and that's where the next skill comes into play. Company invests heavily in projects to innovate, expand, and improve their operations, and they need someone with the expertise to ensure these projects stay on track within budget and meet their goals. Average monthly pay for project manager is about $8,556 a month. But you don't have to pay a single dime to like this video if you're finding any of this high income skills of value to you or interesting for you to dive into. Now, I'm sure you've heard about blockchain as the backbone of cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin or Ethereum, but its potential actually goes way beyond that. Companies worldwide are integrating blockchain into their system like and products, creating a massive demand for skilled developers. For instance, since I'm into real estate, imagine our entire real estate transaction takes place on the blockchain. There's always a security validation for every action that the buyers or seller takes during the transaction, and there can and will be many other implementation of blockchain technology in many more other industries. I mean, think about this. Apple's Vision Pro and MetaQuest, whatever this is, these tech giants are trying to create an alternate universe. And it wouldn't be too surprising if these universes takes place on the blockchain. Not only this skills is in high demand, but you can actually earn well about $8,000 a month. Let me know in the comment section below, yes or no, if you have tried the Apple Vision Pro. I haven't been able to get my hands on it, but I just couldn't justify the $3,500 for a first generation product. AI proficiency. Now, after blockchain, here comes artificial intelligence. A list of high demand skills without talking about the artificial intelligence, that's not happening. Artificial intelligence has completely taken over our lives at a ridiculous pace. No matter whichever industry you're in, AI chatbots are there for you to use them. I mean, OpenAI Sora can now take make videos just from some text input that looks nothing short of real videos. Okay, maybe not that one looks that real, but how about this one? Or this one? Or maybe this one? These are all generated by Sora, just from some text input. And you know what's the crazy part? This video of Will Smith eating spaghettis was generated last year. And in one year, we come from this to this. I mean, okay, these videos are not perfect. If you look closely, the hand movements are weird. AI actually cannot figure out what to do with the hands as of yet. But the shadow, color depth, reasoning are nothing but mind boggling. This is the worst that this tech will ever be. If you just learn how to make the best use of AI tools, you can earn well above $8,000 per month. Have you ever used any AI tools to make money? Let me know in the comment section below. Remember when I told you that I would reveal something about online gurus that they're keeping it on the wrap? This is because they're making more money selling their educational products than they're actually doing the thing that they're telling you to do so. Yes, I'm talking about online courses. Any of the top YouTubers earning you take. Majority of their income come from online course sales. The ad sales may be $5,000 a month from YouTube while they make $30,000 a month from selling their own courses. Trust me, creating online course isn't a big deal, but the earning could go crazy. That also comes with some responsibility. Everyone and their mother is a guru of something on social media nowadays. If you have taken a deep look at yourself, you will find something that you're truly passionate about, that you know the ins and out of it, and someone out there would gladly pay for the talent that you possess to teach them that. But having a talent and making a course will not make you any money if you don't know how to sell it. And that's what brings me to my last high income skill, which not only catapulted my income to a new level, but a skill that's evergreen that no AI or any technology will be ever able to replace it. It will never be out of business, no matter however the economy is doing, and that's sales and marketing. No businesses can survive without sales and marketing. But the problem is that, that the sales drift often get a bad rap of being sleazy. It's because we only know the marketers who are pushing their products and trying to get you to buy something. But in reality, marketing is all about building trust and value. So if you develop a skill to tell a brand story in a very, very, very powerful way, 
then you're going to be very, very, very good at sales app marketing. And guess what? You can expect to earn around 10 to $12,000 a month just like how I did. Now, sharing this 11 high paying skill doesn't mean that you need to go and master each one of them. I'm a fan of focus. Follow one course until successful. You just focus on one skill that you like and get so good at it that other businesses and other clients cannot say no to working with you. And once you find that golden skill, you just have to proceed carefully with your career. But unfortunately, mastering any of this high income skill and making millions will not actually get you out of the financial pinch that you're in if you don't stop wasting money. Now, you may be asking, I don't waste money. Sometimes you don't realize, but you're actually wasting money. How? Find out in this video. If you haven't already, like and subscribe. See you in the next video. SEO involves optimizing, optimizing, optimizing.